everywhere. Some places it's close to the surface where you absolutely have to do it anyhow or suffer the consequences of volcanic eruption. So start wherever you want, but the pitiful excuses to make a joke out of geothermal energy so far and the impediments that the energy cartels have done. Look beyond that. Okay, those guys are fucked. As it is, most of these oil wells, after they inject water back into it, if it makes its way back down to where the original hydrocarbons were cut off from the from the heat, they'll rebuild themselves. <gasps> oh, they do. They do actually refill, and we don't know where it comes from. Okay, but when you got carbon there. Seabed sediments. And it tends to change it. Whatever it goes through, it picks up. And there's enough heat and pressure, it, it changes it into all kinds of things methane, natural gas, methyl hydrates in the ocean floor. That's reacted hydrogen that came out of thermosis chemical thermosis probably. Oh bud, I was just gonna pack up and go. And maybe you should be eating that. <sighs> Let me see that. Yeah, well, we'll let we'll let the coyotes have that, okay? No. Yeah, I don't, I don't want you eating anything here anymore. Okay? No, no. As for the coyotes. No. Sorry, guys. Okay? I'm sorry, buddy. You know, that sucks. Hey, sorry about that. Sometimes you just have to say... Nope. Yeah, no problem, eh? Uh, well, hey, okay, I, I hope, uh, I, don't, I guess, I hope you guys got something out of that. It wasn't a great presentation or anything, but it touched on a few things. Like I said, I'll, I'll put some links down under more information where you can read a few pages to get you started. Clearly, you, you're all bored, you're fucked, you got nothing to do and no way out, so. Rather than go make war, go make energy. Go make hydrogen. Okay. And by the time this is all opening up, we should be in a another solar storm from that filament. Speaking of go making hydrogen. Hey, peace out. <laughs>